Hi guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to do a haul of a few things that I've picked up over the past few months. Um, it's mostly clothes, but I've got a couple of the wee other wee bits and pieces. So I'm just going to get stuck in and show you what I got. So the first thing is from Primark. Uh, it's just this wee cardigan. It's like in a light blue and it has these wee ladybirds on it. Um, it's just really nice. Uh, this is actually in a size 14 because I can't fit into regular size clothes in Primark. So I always size up because I usually like things baggier anyway. Uh, but yeah, it's really nice. It's really light. You know, if you're looking for something just to throw on, but you don't want to really put on your coat, go for this. Next thing I got was a jumper. You might see a bit of a theme coming up in this video. Um, again, from Primark. It's like a bluey green. Um, has we think it says, uh, I think it says Malibu on it. Um, but yeah, long sleeves. Again, I sized up. I believe this is a size, what size is this? Yeah, this is a size 16 um, because I prefer them baggier. Um, and it's not too heavy, which means it kind of like, I can layer things up because I like to like layer up my clothes. Another thing I got was this Pink Floyd t-shirt. I know there's a lot of people going around saying, oh, you can't be wearing the band t-shirts if you don't listen to the band. I was a really big Pink Floyd fan. Sorry, still am a Pink Floyd fan. Um, in tech, I did my whole dissertation on Sid Barrett. And whenever I saw that, I just thought it looked really nice. And I like t-shirts that I can throw on easily. And yeah, it's got like um, a couple of the things on it. But I really liked it. Sometimes it's nice just to pick up an easy, cheap t-shirt. So next I'm going into Zara. I don't know if they're going to still have these here, like in the shops, but um, yeah, I mean, our weather in Northern Ireland over the past kind of, probably about six or eight weeks has just been so warm. It's so hot. And, you know, I just don't know why I keep buying jumpers, you know, let's just keep buying jumpers anyway. And um, so I got this one. It's just stripey, and it's kind of long, got long sleeves, but I just saw it, and you know when sometimes you just see things and you're like, I just really want it, it's just something that's so easy, it goes with everything, um, and it was like a tenner, so I just, um, I couldn't help myself. Yeah, I also bought this, which is like, it's hard to show you in the light, it's like a, like a really light pink. And then it kind of pinches in a wee bit at the arms and the arms go into these sleeves. Really nice on just with like a pair of jeans. You can dress it up or dress it down. But I just really liked it. Again, I think this was like a tenner as well. So I just couldn't help myself. The next one is this. I've been wearing this loads. Uh, actually, <laughs> it's, uh, it's inside out, but probably not that it matters. You can't really tell on camera, but you know, I'll try and be a bit professional. So yeah, it's just a grey kind of t-shirt and um, it has these like flute kind of sleeves, which I really like. Not the easiest to play guitar with, but I kind of just like shut them up my arms and hope for the best. Um, but yeah, this was in a size medium. But yeah, it's just nice with jeans, you know, pair of tight jeans, we tight top and then it kind of flutes out at the arms. But it does make it right way. Next thing is um, from Marks and Spencers. I had went into Marks and Spencers I don't know, a couple of weeks ago. This is definitely still in Marks and Spencers because I was actually in the other day. Um, I think looking for food or something, can't remember. But I saw it because I also have it still in white. And it is this jumper. It's really heavy. It's got this really thick kind of material. And it has these wee details on the arms. And then it has this tie at the back. There's actually a lot of really nice stuff at Marks and Spencers at the minute. I just haven't had the chance or the cash because I booked a holiday to go out and buy a lot of things, but there is some really nice stuff. Um, I definitely think once I get a couple of paychecks together, I think I gotta go shopping back there. Um, oh, I forgot about this from Primark. I wear this every day. Every day that comes, rain, snow, winter time, sun shines, and it's this denim jacket. And I just love it. I got it in a size 12 and thank, thank, thank Christ I picked it up because I haven't seen them since. Like in any other Primarks I went into, I haven't seen them. And it's got like easy details. I stuck some badges on it. Oh yeah, I could actually show you these. I was in um, Forever 21 whenever I was on my trip to Dublin 
and I think I'll bring them close to you so you can see it. It's like milk and bacon and eggs. I just thought that was so cool. I was like, I love milk, I love bacon and I love eggs. So I just picked it all up. But yeah, it's a really nice jacket. Um, you'll get to see it on the try on. So I also picked up this kind of like shirt kind of thing in Stradivarius, which is kind of like, I haven't actually been on the website, but whenever I go in, it kind of reminds me of Zara. I'm going to guess like maybe the makes are very similar. I'm sure someone will be able to tell me, but I just saw this wee white top and it had this wee neck ruffle. It gets wrinkled really easily. And then it has this wee pocket at the front. I just thought it was kind of cool. Um, these short sleeves. I don't know. I just saw it hanging up. I think it was about twenty pounds, and I just, I just really liked it. I was like, that looks kind of nice. It'll be nice with like nice blue jeans, nice over underneath my denim jacket. Um, so yeah, just thought I'd grab it. This next thing I have worn twice. I've only had it about a week and a bit, um, but. I just really liked it. I was out, I was out shopping. No, I wasn't actually. I was out having coffee with my friend, and um, afterwards I said, "Dear, have you ever been to Oliver Bonus?" And she was like, "No, never been. Don't even think I've heard about it." So we dandered up the road, and I took her in, and she was like, "Oh, this is so nice." So I was looking around, went over to the sale reel, and I picked up this. It's quite hard to see, um but it's like a long kind of shirt dress and I just thought it was so nice. It's made out of what feels like a, like a, like a suede kind of material, but you know, I'm, it's hard for me to sometimes pull off some colors, but I saw this and I tried it on. It goes actually really well with jeans. It also goes well if you just want to put on some tights. It has these wee ties at the sides. You can kind of pinch it in at the waists, but yeah, that was, that was 65 I believe down to 40 um, and I had, I had some tip money saved up from doing my cafe work so I just thought you know what stuff it I'm gonna get it this isn't mine but uh, I just thought it was really cool I don't know if any of you guys have been watching Breaking Bad I am on I will be watching the last episode tonight um, so I can't wait to see it just thought one last night one tonight save it and you know to see how it goes so it was Daniel's birthday two weeks ago so I bought him what a white necklace it's just a plain black t-shirt and it's just got the wee uh, things on it I just really liked it I thought he would like it I've worn it a couple of times twice um but yeah it was out got it off Redbubble and um got it a large and it's just nice, you know, Redbubble has all those wee things that you need and he is sometimes quite difficult to buy for. But I know he loves Breaking Bad, um, so I just saw that. Plain black t-shirt, you can wear it like whenever he likes and I can put it on whenever I like. Also from Redbubble, I bought him this. I think this is class. It's a Rick and Morty Breaking Bad themed cushion. I don't think Daniel's really into cushions. He's a guy, obviously. But I just thought it was really cool. Um, if I can show you, it's meant to be Jesse and Walt, but in Rick and Morty theme. This is really this this next thing is really random, but I just really liked it. And um, it's a tiny little suitcase. Don't know what I'm gonna put in it. Probably nothing. It's been sitting by my fireplace for like the past like three months. I got it out of TK Maxx, the label is still on it. But do you ever get it, you're just walking around TK Maxx and you just see something that looks so cool and you're like, I just want that. I have absolutely no purpose for this, no point for this, no need for it, but you just gotta get it. So it's got these wee buckles and then it opens up. It's just a wee case. I'm sure I will find something for it. If not, it'll just sit at my fireplace and look wonderful. So this is the last thing I bought. This is my favorite thing whenever I saw it. I saw it um, on Helen Anderson's YouTube page and whenever she got it, I was like, that's like the most amazing thing I've ever seen. And I was like, I need to get this. But whenever I went online, they didn't have it. It was sold out. I waited for easily like two months. Um, but the story behind this is whenever I went, my sister was going out with a guy and he had this amazing like cardigan 
and it was all like multicolored. and I took it to San Francisco with me and whenever I got back he wanted it back so I had to give him it back because it was his but then I saw this and it was the Lazy Oaf Rainbow Boring Cardigan and like I got it maybe the delivery actually came really quick I got it on I think I wrote it on Saturday night and it was here Monday morning but I just I just absolutely loved it there's something about it it just makes me feel so happy I was out seeing my friends and I wore it today I actually got stopped whenever I was in Tesco because it was like a wee old granny she came up to me and she was like oh I love your cardigan I was like thanks I love it too <laughs> but yeah it was just there's just something about it it's really nice it is a wee bit on the pricey side for me anyway this cost 75 pound I think that included the shipping but I mean I have been after something like this for maybe maybe three or four years so whenever I saw this I just had to get it I love it it's like my favorite purchase in I don't know how long a long time but yeah so yeah, that's me. Um, just a quick haul of just a couple of things I've been wearing over the past while. You'll probably see me wearing them for the next year. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you liked it. Um, maybe you'll want to click on a couple of things and buy them yourself. And yeah, thanks for watching. Um, you can, what can you do? You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all at Sonia Slater. Um, I'm also on Facebook and I this YouTube channel. So you can subscribe and apparently you have to click a bell or something that notifies people. I don't know, I'm still all new to this. But yeah, um, thanks very much for watching, guys. And I will see you soon.